Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Maggie. If this is your first time stopping by, I hope you decide to like and subscribe and click that notification bell. Come back and check out some of the other content on my channel. As you saw from the title, this is a Dollar Tree shop with me. This is one of the large volume stores that's near where I used to work. And so I'm looking to see what they have. It's been a while since I've been there. So I wanna go in and see what kind of fall and Christmas items they might have out. Cause I've noticed they're starting to put the bags, Christmas bags out. So let's see what they got. Christmas florals and let's see, do they have anything new here? Yeah, this store will always have like, these are velvet. Nice. Berries. Pine cone picks. Great for wreath making and floral arranging. The glittery stems. I don't think we had this last year. It's kind of a teal. Look at all that. Nice. Okay, this is early when it first opened, so I'm hoping that I'm not going to get a lot of noise. Here are the Halloween things. I really don't do Halloween, but for those who, who do. Okay. I'm actually going to be going on a trip and I leave Halloween on the 31st. I'm going to New Hampshire. Oh, this is okay. See here, look. This is the Christmas. Look at that. Look at that. All Christmas. Okay. I don't think they had these last year, but let me move this up where it belongs. Okay. I don't think they had those last year, but yeah, these, these tensely things are not my favorite, but I know they they're very weatherproof, so these would be good to hang on the outside of your house. Red trucks and all. They're, I mean, they aren't my favorite, but they're very festive. These little advent calendars are adorable. It's little Velcro, and you just put them there. I got one of these. I think it was a snowman one. It could be a Santa one, but I have that on my granddaughter's door whenever it's close to that time. The reindeer, the snowflakes, these felt figures that have their arms and legs tucked up behind. Okay, and the little elf guy. These are cute. Now this is new. I haven't seen this. That is adorable. I know it's a little early for Christmas and some people get a little salty about, you know, um, oh, look at those. These are new colors this year. These are cute. Great centerpieces if you're doing a party. Um, I get a little salty about Christmas being out now, but think of people that need to prepare for, um, crafting fairs and things like that. So I get it. I get it. Oh, this one's new. I love it. These two are kind of three-dimensional. That's adorable. Very farmhouse. That's three-dimensional. There's another one. I love these. I think I have one. This looks like it's been updated a little bit, but that's one. That one's very basic. Very nice. Your kisses were snowflakes. I'd send you a blizzard. I love that. These are nice big signs too. These are mats, doormats. So, I mean, they're not super sturdy, but oops, oh my gosh, of course. I was trying to stack them all on top of one another. <clears throat> okay, love that. And these are carryovers from last year. Those are returning. Cute. Happy holidays. Very nice. Okay, 
these are the stocking holders. Have the little hook on the end. And the ornaments. Some are carryovers from last year, returning, which I love. I've gone through some of these. They usually have a lot more than others, but think of things like um, personalizing them, using them as a place card for a dinner party, using them as tags on a gift. You could even, if you did um, ornaments for your children each year, personalize the back with the year on it. I've done that. These are nice. These would, this would be great for personalization to commemorate a specific event or as a place card at a dinner party. Okay. I did some napkin rings with these last year. Very nice. These are fabric with foam on the inside. Very pretty. I've done napkin rings with these. I did them with the white and the silver, I believe. Okay. And then down here we have the tubes of the small, that's an LED ornament. Okay. The top twists. And then there's a light on the inside. Turn it off. But uh, there's, there's the twisting cap, which is cute. You see how they're almost gone. These are the icicle ornaments. Six. So those are long. Okay. The hooks and the different things. Directly behind me are these, this fall display. These are great in that they can be completely personalized. And then there's Halloween stuff, skeletons, skulls, pumpkins, and things that hang, which we've been seeing everywhere. So this end cap also is getting picked clean. And then they're starting to get the loot bags out for Christmas. There's 25 here, six here, and there's different styles. Yep. Okay. Okay, what are these? Okay, these are money holders. There's eight. And these are Christmas cards. See, they didn't do Christmas cards very much last year. I'm wondering if they're all going to be like this. I may have to get a pack just to see. This one is Oh Holy Night. Okay, let me... Hold this so you can see it. Let me just grab this from the top. Okay, these are the cards that are inside. Which, these are pretty... They're not doing the boxes anymore. So that's super nice. The store always gets a lot. And then here are the aloe socks. Okay, these aren't regular, these are aloe socks. And here are the Snugadoo Christmas socks, which are cute. The fabric bags. These, I've, I saw somebody doing an Operation Christmas Child um, thing and they put things inside these kind of fabric bags like the hair things and I thought oh my gosh That's such a great idea There are the Christmas buckets and then these are treat bags. These are new. I haven't seen these. There's tin furry and bright. I Love these paper. Oh my gosh. I love that and not just that here. Look at these treat bags And paper crafting you could just cut each of these out individually although those look a little off like they're blurry. And then here are the metal tins up here. Cute. And then these are the plastic. These have 15 of the clear. They used to come in 20 and 25. So I see what they're doing there. And then these are the fun little festive headbands. So cute. 
these funny neckties. Okay. Trays. These are plastic. Have a great day. Metal. Plastic. The novelty pencils. These are great for making chocolates, candy canes, and these are the chair backs, which I actually turned these into pillows, and then these small little miniature containers, and knee highs. So lots of fall decor and craft. Paint sets. These would be cute if you're going to have little ones come over for your Thanksgiving meal to have a little fun activity for them to do, whether it's with paints or something else. Mm -hmm. Lots of the pumpkins. Look at that. Look at that. Muffins, too. You know? Okay, this end cap has Light and Sound Snowman and Santa and then the lights. That's very cute. <laughs> LED candle with a timer. Okay, there's a timer on that. All right. And these are the snowflake lights. And I think these are just the plain colored lights. Yeah. Don't forget that there are gift cards here. Boy. Yeah, can't walk by here without that happening. <laughs> okay, now this aisle is got some pet costumes in it and dress up things for the kids. Okay, that's gonna get old fast. <laughs> Wings, wigs, mustaches, feather boas. Y'all see it. The little accessories. Up here are the tiaras and there's only one of these left. Okay. These are the cute little candy buckets. I like the kitty cat and the fun jack-o'-lantern. But there's all kinds, funny, goofy string. And then these little, these are like the um, shopping bags, but you could use these as bags for if you take your child trick-or-treating or you participate in a festival at your church. So there's that. Okay, this is a little end cap of LA Colors. You never know where these are gonna be found. Some of these colors are very pretty for the fall. This one is called Keeper, Beloved, Bow. They all look very similar, but there's just little nuances. BFF, this one has a lot of pink in it. Okay, this is Lip Mousse, and then some of these lip crayons. So snatched, these go on very smoothly. Sass, this is one I have at home. I love it. And then the eyeliners and lip liners down there. On the end of this row is the wooden things for DIYs and ornaments. You have the snowman, the Christmas tree, and this is to make a 3D craft kit. So, you have all of that. They've never offered that before. And then just these wood shapes. Very nice. And this end cap has all the bottle brush trees. All different kinds. Look at this though. This one has the pearls in it already. So if you're making a village, which I do have a little village I make. Oh, this one has the 
the gold bead garland on it. All different colors and shapes. So grab the one you like. Okay, here are some more. These are not pom-poms. I'm calling these snowballs. I've gotten those before. I used them in one of my, in my Christmas displays. And then I have some um, decorative porcelain dolls, snow babies. And so I have these for that. Actually, you know what? I think I'm going to grab one of those. These are cute. And then you have all the glittery pipe cleaners and the ribbons. And then we're starting to come out with the ribbon. I've done quite a few make costumes and things. These are cute. Pom poms. You literally can get your whole house decorated at the Dollar Tree. Here's some more of the Christmas wooden craft kits. And the other things that you can DIY. I love it. So cute. I don't know. Are these new? Have we have they had these before? Okay, this comes with markers. Well, oh, that's cute. Color your own. Okay. And then of course these. These are some gift tags, felt finger puppets, I've done these before, they're adorable. And then this is a pom-pom craft to make the reindeer. And then they have the felt ornaments for the penguin and the snowman and Santa. Very nice. Alright, this end cap has quite a few of the Christmas stories. Okay. Twas the night before Christmas. I have all that. Illustrated by David Cutting. This is an animated video book. You can sing along. Very cute. I'm gonna get it. Okay. Fa la 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 llama. This is a pretty thick color book. Very cute. Okay, gingerbread Christmas sticker activity book. Oh, how fun. Okay. And there seems to be another one back here. These are great stocking stuffers or things to have on hand if you're going to have people come over. Peanuts. It says there's a holiday stand up on the back. Oh, I love it. Okay, that's going in my cart. They also have Avengers and Elf on the Shelf, plus the Grinch. And then these others, Sweet Holiday, Magical Christmas, Snowy Day, and then this Jumbo. Trolls over here, what is this? Mini sticker activity book. Oh wait, what is this? Are you making scenes? It must be. That's another cute one. Oops. Okay, and then this funny faces. Very cute. All right. Making my way down the book and toy aisle. See if there's any new stories. Of course, we have the Hardy Boys. Nancy Drew, the store's pretty well kept.
new? It might be. Okay. I have all these. <laughs> That's so funny. I have all these. Yeah. I do have a vast child's book collection. Spot the differences are so fun. Okay. Very nice. And then, of course, the office supplies. I really shouldn't walk down this aisle because of my addiction. <laughs> it's fine, it's fine, everything's fine. for the construction paper that was skin toned. It was the, you know, the Crayola colors of the world. It, um, was supposed to be after those and I'm always on the look for some new highlighters or something that, so I'm not seeing anything that I haven't seen before. The five markers, super tips, and this is not as your best deal. Your best deal will probably be at Walmart for this, but that's a convenient, you know, you can run in and grab it. But start looking for things that you can get, including the pencil pouches with pencils and pens and sharpeners for the Operation Christmas Child boxes. That's such a worthy cause to be involved with. <clears throat> School supplies and um, a toy and some hygiene items. Wow, watercolor pencils, huh, okay, let me try these, that's new, 2024 calendars are still there, still in the stores, I would hope so, these are the student planners, the mailing section. And organizing. Half a pen. is the pegboard system. It's really good. I use it on my side card. Oh, look. They also have these in the, the rose gold. Very nice. My daughter needed one today and I didn't have one, so I must have gotten rid of them. This is corner office. Some more high end items to organize. Very nice. Jot corner office. And then they have the jot writing corner office, and then there's just your regular jot. anywhere. These are bookends. And I love the school things. Look, there's a magnifying glass, rulers, calculators, and then coming over here you have stickers. 
things you can definitely use in your homeschooling or in your um, classroom with your teacher. I love these paper shapes. You could actually, I love that it seems to have a variety of colors in it. You could make paper dolls to go with it. That could be a fun activity. And then some more of these learning books. And classroom decor. This is just star like. Also, these things could be used in paper crafting as well. I love it. Very nice. The store always has the best stock of Hot Wheels and Matchbox cars. I see collectors in here all the time. The launchers and the tracks and the loop-de-loops, those are all great. There's the Matchbox cars. I'm getting down into the Lego sets or the block sets. Now this is a case that's empty, but you can use it to definitely organize or bring on the road, traveling, doing something, having a small amount to take with you. And then these are these sets. These are fun stocking stuffers. They have a variety of them. Really cute if you want to encourage. These would be great for um, uh, the Operation Christmas Child boxes for boys and girls because they like the cars and to be able to build something. I think it's helpful for all of them. <clears throat> Here are the fashion dolls. If I got these, it would... Oh, excuse me. They put some articulation in the knees. When did that happen? I may have to get one. Just, I'm gonna get one. Even if it's just for the fashion, just to see how all that works. Okay, all right Dollar Tree, I see what you're doing. Okay. Okay. Here's the play food, which I've gotten all of these. They work wonderful. My granddaughter loves it. Mobile team. Okay, these are your little action figures. And they're marking these limited edition. I don't know if it's because they have gold on them or what. Okay. Here are the Barbie brand things we've seen everywhere else. Here are the Forever Friends figures. If you need to restock the dresses, the cases for them. I'm still waiting on the play sets to come in. Or even new outfits. Oh my goodness. What is this? Okay. We have these. There's the new ones. Bacon, eggs, and bread. And then that one is a burger and fries. That's a nice, that's brand new. Squishies. And the wish games. It's cute. There's the little furniture. All the colors. Okay, and then you got the figures here, which are really cute. We don't have Big Bird. All right. I've come down the card and I'm in going into the craft section. I am looking for the faux fur that they have. This is all the blue, the blue fabric and then this pretty tropical print and then some of these others. But I'm not seeing, this is the burlap, I'm not seeing the faux fur that I've been looking for. Okay, here's the paper packs and more of the cutting dies for, I did get some of that fusible webbing. I haven't tried it yet, but I will. Beads and strings. Look at this. Nice. Okay. So we have the 
pink and orange and the blue and white. And then this has the black and gray and the pinks. Very nice. And then we cut down into the sticker section. I'm noticing oh God, clear stamps. Okay, these are new. And then here is the craft and activity section. These are really nice. You have this one, this one, and that one with the markers. Very nice. Cards, the craft sets, these are all great to have. This is a fun card game. What is this? It's a game. Can you bark like a dog while flapping like a chicken, squawk like a dolphin, stomp like a tiger? Oh my gosh, how fun. That seems like that would be a very fun game and a great little fun thing to do on Christmas Eve. <laughs> Family time. Okay. These are cute. I got those for my granddaughter and they work really well. Alrighty. There's the plushies. The Arthur and the Berenstain Bears. Nice. They have a very vast candle aisle that's very well kept. Dragon fruit. Lavender fields. Apple cinnamon. Dragon fruit must be a new one they've added, but I'm not going to pull it out because I don't want to mess that up. Okay. Blueberry lavender. Salted watermelon. Mahogany and tea. Coconut. Look at these incense trays. I guess you put the incense thing inside. You could also use that for rings if you wanted. Apple cinnamon. Oh, these are nice. Look at those jars. I can't smell anything, but they're very pretty. Okay, I just noticed Dapple Baby has a breast pump and accessory cleaner, removes tough breast milk residue, and then the Dapple Baby disinfecting spray, which I have seen in other places. Okay. This is, they're, they're currently stocking. If you see that. So, I'm a bath time. Alright, they're stocking in quite a few places, but uh, they do have these brushes, which are really nice and flexible. I think they're like detangling brushes. I mean, I found some treasures. There's the Friends socks that I've been looking for. And then these these are new um, linen and room spray. So you can spray this on your linens. Brown vanilla sugar scent. Apple cinnamon scent. And then there's this Island Vibe room spray. Oh my gosh, you guys, I'm hitting the jackpot. There's the friend socks I was looking for. <laughs> okay, they do have the Heatless Curling Headband set. The one I got from Timo I thought was too big. That might be a better size. And then, of course, they have the Scunchy brand barrettes. You see the backs? So it's the snap and pop. Okay. And tissues. And the fancy pearl, although always the, the fancy ones come out during the holidays. Head wrap. Okay. These never successfully stay on my head. Scunchy brand, there's, I thought there were two. That's one. Okay, more headbands. All kinds of pretty things. So. I have been using these, the 
coconut infused. These are lavender infused, but to scrub my face. And I'm noticing a difference just in a couple of days of doing that, but you're supposed to use it to exfoliate. This is a bathing cloth, and these are the bathing gloves, bath gloves. I've been using them to scrub my face, and it's working that I can see. Okay, all kinds of beautiful spa things you can use to put together stocking stuffers or gift gift baskets. This is for the neck. I'm gonna try it. It's a two pack. Let me get another one. <laughs> Just because. Okay. All right, now I'm in the makeup aisle. I'm always looking because they usually have unique things. What's this? Nail art tools. Oh my gosh. Look at this. You guys. You could use that just in regular crafting. Okay, that looks new. Jewelry cleaner spray. Okay, I'm gonna try some of this because I need, sometimes your jewelry just needs a refresh. Okay. These are masks. I don't think I've tried that. Oh, yeah. It's almost at $2,000 an ounce now. These are the flower. Okay. Name brands. This is a deep cleansing acne scrub. I haven't tried that. I didn't see anything particularly new. It's an eyeshadow. Nice. Okay. <clears throat> Coming down this way. These are the cough drops and Hall's defense. Okay, these were the I tried the, the uh, snack ones, and those were actually super good. These are the powdered drink mixes. Okay. This is a good time to stock up on things that you think you might need. Here are the vitamins that I love that I just restocked. Let me grab a few more of these, because these help me kick a cold's butt. <laughs> and the turmeric and ginger, okay. Pill cutters, stock up your first aid kit, make sure you have all the stuff you need. Aspirins, Tylenol, electrolytes. Golden flu season's coming up, so it's a good time to grab some over-the-counter stuff that you could use. Okay. Angle supports, okay. I think we're good with everything else. Don't overlook the True North four packs. The cucumber lime is pretty good. My favorite is the black cherry, which is shocking to me because black cherry is not my favorite flavor. But of the True North seltzer waters, the, it's like the best one. Okay, and looking since I'm in um, the mode of putting together meal emergency meal packs, this is a cooking sauce, garlic, honey, mustard. I haven't tried this, but it's a Campbell's brand. So I haven't, I don't know what that costs anywhere because I didn't know that product existed. But this is a good place. I'm looking for the real Parmesan cheese, which is down here. This is what I was looking for. It's the right size for meals. So let me, not the grated topping, the actual Parmesan cheese. I have some meal kits I need to put together. That I need to add that to so and those are things I'm not going to be just saving but I'm going to be using cycling through here's some lentils I'm gonna grab a couple bags of this and then cheese sauce to make mac and cheese all of that. I did not have lentils. I have some of the jalapeno cheese, but I didn't have any of the original cheese. Let me grab another one of those. 
but basically the idea and I'll be doing a filming of that as well so you guys can see how I do it hmm. that's got more shelf life yeah see the expiration date isn't until 2025 so if you eat a lot of that it's a good thing to get Squeeze, tear, heat, remove. Okay. <clears throat> Things that are shelf stable that are going to last a while. Um, one pouch is one serving. Get, having some of these on hand to be able to eat to keep the proteins up and everything else. If anything ever happened and you would, you would lose access to shopping for food or ingredients, whether it's a natural disaster or power outages or what's going on, who knows. But finding things and then use, looking at the sodiums and making sure, you know, you're keeping aware of all that too. I'm not a fan of sardines or seafood, so that's off my list. Okay, and then look for your, your better, um, your better deals. I haven't really investigated that as much as I should. <laughs> Sometimes it's good to have those things. And then lunches, the little tidbits and fruits and all that stuff. So good stuff. All right, and then coming down these storage container aisles, I'm not really seeing much of anything that I haven't seen in other places. Um, trash bags. I know you get better deals other places. These are good. These work and they're leak proof. Those are great instead of using plastic wrap. On the other side of the aisle we have the organizer trays. And I'm trying to keep my eyes out for oh my god this is a Bed Bath & Beyond product. Okay, I'm grabbing a couple of these. Bed Bath & Beyond products are making their way into the stores. Okay. <laughs> this is a drawer organizer. Also a Bed Bath & Beyond product. Okay. I got a few drawers who could stand with some organizing. <clears throat> okay. Do they have any canning funnels here, I wonder? These tools are pretty good. Splatter screens, that's really good. Love that. Okay. Okay, I'm on the other side of the store. This will be it, but I knew shocked me. I noticed these ice buckets. Those are new. I haven't seen those before. And coming down the gift wrap aisle. Looking to see what's here. Wait, are these... Oh, those are something else. There's a new one they have that's like that. That has a stand so you can stand them directly on your table. Here's the gift wrap. I don't think the um, Christmas wrap is coming out yet. Where is it? Here's your tape. Here are the bags. I don't, th these might be new for the year but they're just starting to get their way in. They're in a small end cap. At one point, they will take over the store, the front end, and then the small ones. They have a pretty nice party section. Okay. These are balloon strings with little charms, so it would have stars, hearts, and unicorns. This one has cupcakes. One up here has butterflies. Very cute. And this one is It's a Girl. Cute. Now that's an LED figure candle. I know they had those out for graduation. You can tell by that. So. I 
I've never seen those. How cute. For a little jungle themed birthday. That's adorable. I've never seen that. And the zipper bags. And all the candles and the papers. Okay, that's it for me. I'm gonna go up to the register. I didn't come in here to buy anything, but we all know how that works in Dollar Tree. I hope you decide to like and subscribe and click the notification bell. Come back and check out some of the other content on my channel. And I just found out they're opening a new Dollar Tree in Hickory, which is maybe a 30, 40 minute drive. The manager here is transferring there. So I'm like, oh my gosh. So I may have a new haul oh, or shop with me coming up at a brand spanking new Dollar Tree sometime in mid-November. So bye until next time.